Regulators! Mount up. Hey everybody, Lewis here. Our shack barbecue and other thing. Well, it's a beautiful day. Even though it's cold out here, it's probably 30 degrees. <sighs> not sure if you can see my breath or not, but uh, I ordered something uh, from the local big box uh, hardware store and uh, it came in. Um, and I'm gonna put it in the uh, RTAC testing facility. Uh, gotta move some stuff around because it's pretty crowded in there uh, and then make room for it. Uh, then I'm gonna run to this place and pick it up as it's in now and then I gotta figure out how I'm gonna get it from my back gate over there over to here because we got all that snow. And, uh, got my utility trailer over there but it don't roll very well in the snow so uh, Anyway, we'll get it over here, but I'm going to work on uh, moving some stuff around in there and uh, I'll have to store it in the shack. I'll have to store it in the... I'll have to take the stuff out of here and put it in the shop for right now because of winter and then uh, probably, I don't know, sell it come springtime. But anyhow, let's get in here and uh, figure out what I'm going to do. All right, so the stainless steel table is gonna go out of here. Um, I have a uh, old chopping block table back there that I'm gonna get out and move that out of here. Uh, it just uh, never sat level. Um, so I just kind of stuck it in the corner. Uh, I'll probably move uh, the 22 inch WSM back in there. And then my uh, charcoal Weber uh, gasser, little uh, go anywhere, I'll probably put back in there. Try to clean out that corner so I can get these back in there. And then, uh, yeah, uh, we'll just get this kind of organized so I can get this other piece of equipment in here. But So, start here. For now, I'm just going to set this over here on the Lone Star. mineral oil probably go put that in the shop so it doesn't uh, freeze this was water frozen solid man <laughs> all right probably put that out there too probably don't crack we'll just set this over there we'll get this table out of here first come on charlie charlie all right my little uh, table here out. This out there. Okay. All right. Let's get this thing over here. I don't know why I keep this in here. I just like it in here. Never ever use it, but I just like it in here. This is the uh, cover I put on the uh, PK. That over there. So this is that uh, butcher block. I want these to stay out here. Find a home for them in a bit. Anyway, this is the butcher block table here. I mean, I picked it up for like 40 bucks. It's done okay. Uh, but uh, Casters don't want to stay on it, and uh, it's just low. So, it's time to move it out of here, I guess. Let me get this. Pan up. And right now, I don't even know where those casters are. Oh, that's good up there. Get my hand truck. I'm just going to lay it over on my hand truck and move it out of here. It ain't light, that's for sure. It's a nice, nice work top. 
I'll probably, I don't know what I'll do with it. Right now, I don't even know where the casters are. And I have my kegerator here. I gotta build that out sometime. But for now, I'm just gonna put the, uh, I think the WSM will go here, and then I'll just put the uh, go anywhere Weber in front of them. I can always move that out of the way. This little uh, 14 inch uh, Weber WSM back here. Yeah, I need to figure out what I'm gonna do. I've got some remodeling I need to do. I wish it was bigger. <laughs> but, no, it is what it is. Yeah, I don't know what made me think I could lift that by one hand. She goes. All right. I'm trying to think because I do use my WSM quite a bit. I should just put this back in the corner and then put those two in front of it. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see what happens here. Isn't that a cutie? That is a cutie. Let's see if we get this back in there. Oh. Beer fridge is hitting it. And I can't bring that over anymore. Right there. Refreshing cola. <laughs> nice thing, this keeps it well insulated. They don't freeze out here. That's all I have in it right now is just that cola. Let those lights come up. Warm up and then it'll be nice and bright. But all right, so. This thing, I'm gonna do something. I think I'm gonna find a new home for my uh, deep fryer too. I'm gonna put that in the shop. I'm gonna put that in the shop. Uh, tape measure. So this thing that I'm getting is 52 inches. So 
might be something like about like that. I'll fit in here. My goal is I wanted it to fit in here. So we can kind of I'll be close. We'll figure it out. I mean it can go right there from now. I like I like having access to my two 26 inch uh, Weber's got my 22 inch WSM this box here. Can't go out of here. And then uh, got my PK for small oak hooks. Um, got my big offset over there. And then I need to clean this corner up some. Kind of became my junk corner uh, for all everything else. And then uh, got the tripod sitting on my rent deck. But uh, my heater here. We'll probably fire that up later today. Uh, but yeah. All right. This should work for now. We'll see how it does. So, you get those out and then uh, go to the Home Depot or the local box stores, some people like to call it, or it through Home Depot. So, go pick that up and bring it in here. So, we'll go get it. Okay, I'm back from the uh, hardware store with the item. So, gonna wheel it in here. We'll see how I, if I can get in here without hitting anything. I'm kind of tall, only 6'5 on a good day, but it's nice to have something that raises up and gets up high like that. It's got locking casters on it, so I can set it and then it's going to move and stay right there. Yeah. Then, bonus. Got two drawers. Think of all the stuff I can cram into those. Like the handle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's in there. It does come with feet, adjustable feet if you'd rather do feet. Brought a towel with me. The owner's manual. Yeah, that's nice. And then uh, got my other cutting board. Set that on here. Gives me a lot more room to have my, uh, oh, like my pink butcher paper. I always struggle where I'm going to set that on that other work table. There. I'm not going to use this as a cutting board, um, but uh, just as a worktop. I might do some prepping, but I'll have uh, mainly the cutting board on top of it. But yeah, there it is. Ideally, I want to put it in here. Um, don't use this soda machine that much, but the plan is uh, to get this out of here this spring. I have another one, uh, an older Pepsi machine that I'm going to put in here in its place. Not sure if I'm going to put it there or not, um, but uh, we'll figure that out during the springtime. Uh, and then uh, I might do some remodeling in here. Might put the Pepsi machine over in that corner. I don't know. Uh, but uh, I want to get this one out of here. I'll probably sell it. That's completely working. Uh, the coin mechanism part doesn't work and the door doesn't lock. But, uh, you know, lights work and it does dispense. And uh, if somebody had modified it, you just push the button and it resets it and drops a, drops a can out when you select which one you want. But yeah, it's just, 
it's just, just so big in here. Um, like I said, I have a smaller, older Pepsi machine that works. Uh, that uh, I don't think the I don't think the coin mechanism works on it, but the dispensers do, and it uh, the refrigerator coolant thing or Freon in it uh, works, but uh, and the lights work on it too. But I'm going to move that one out here, and then I even have an older one, but uh, it doesn't work. It it doesn't dispense. It's just for decoration. Lights work on it. Anyhow, uh, yeah, so this is what I got, a new work table. Uh, I know, as uh, my buddy John would say, trying to jam one more thing in this overcrowded area already. I know, John, I know. But uh, got to get ready for a catering jig. Got to get ready for a couple of cooks here. So, yeah, I like it. I like it a lot. I like the fact that it's adjustable and the wheels lock and I can move it around you know we'll see eventually I'd like to get it over there and maybe move the uh, oh the let's see we got the flat top and one of the 26 inch uh, Weber's out of there maybe move them who knows but, all right like I always say thank you for watching okay you could do this too till next time my friends pretty long well.